practicing stuff the whole week. Um, so I did a lot of like regen and got a tub, and got massages and stuff, took care of my body, got a sauna and sweat a little bit. So yeah, I did a lot of um, preparing my body. Um, and then yeah, I went home, saw my mom, my little sister, and uh, a lot of my friends and stuff. So it was good. Got, um, got like rebooted uh, physically and mentally. So. Jared, you guys have had a lot of success in the red zone this year. You guys have not scored on only two of your 31 opportunities. What do you think? Makes you guys so successful in the red zone, and James mentioned it earlier the ability of you guys both run and pass the ball down there. And how much does that give Coach Ronnie confidence to call plays down there? Um, I feel like that gives a lot of confidence because uh, defense are always guessing. You never know what we're going to do because we do uh, we do really good. So um, just having the, the game plan and what Coach Ronnie calls and what he feels comfortable with, and uh, just calling and we score like we have been here. Sir, uh, we were asking Coach Franklin about you know the whole one and zero mantra and how you guys it seems like now aren't just repeating it but are embracing it. I guess for you, when did you kind of embrace that mindset, um, and how did you go about that? Um, it, it I, me personally, it, it just takes a lot of stress off you. You know, um, you don't have to worry about the, like the future. You don't have to worry about what happened before. Um, you focus on what's coming up and what you got to do. You know. Um, that one no mentality, I mean, I was kind of bought into that when I, when I first got here. It just uh, kind of preached my own type of method, just focus on the now, worry about the other stuff later. Hey, Jeremy, back here. Tell me about uh, challenges as far as defense presents this weekend. Um, just, just how athletic they are and how they move, you know. Uh, when they, uh, their blitz schemes and all that good stuff, they, they do everything very well. And uh, we just got to be prepared for what they throw at us. And, and just be ready. Anything else for Journey? Do you look forward to playing in a place that you've never been before? Oh yeah, you know, um, I've never been to Minnesota, uh, but it's always fun to, to go travel and stuff and, and play. And I'm like very excited to play in an environment like this. And the game is technically at 11 there locally. Yeah. Is that, I, I mean, I imagine that you guys are not getting up, but. 10.30 when it's noon anyway. So right. I mean, is, is that a thing that actually makes a difference, or is it, it um, just doesn't matter? No, I'm, I'm like a green light. I'm always on go, so I'm not, I'm not worried about the time. Hey, Jeremy. Um, I know none of you guys uh, in that backfield are accustomed to being 25 carry guys over the course of your college career, but through eight games, because you have shared those reps, do you get the sense that you're all you know, we know Noah's a little banged up, but you're all a little bit more healthier than, than the average, you know, running back might be in college football at this time because you have shared that load. Um, yeah, you know, I feel I feel good. You know, I, we all kind of feel good because uh, how we share the load and how we do things uh, here. But um, yeah, I guess you could say I feel better. I don't know how other guys feel, so I can't really speak on it. But uh, I definitely feel good, fresh, and always go every weekend. Early in the season, it was. A it still is, but it is a topic of conversation. Who's going to be the lead back? Who's going to be the lead back? At this point, um, how did it kind of get to this where everybody is, you know, if, if I'm starting, that's great. If I'm not, I'll get in there. How, how long did it take that to feel natural to the group? That was um, from the get-go. You know, that started in camp. You know, Coach uh, Sutter told us it was going to be like this. And uh, for for me personally, it didn't, I don't care if I get one yard, one carry. Um, it, it, we have a mentality, if one of us eats, we all eat. So I'm, I'm comfortable for whoever starts her. If it's me, it's me. If I get 30 carries a game, that's so be it. If I get one carry a game, as long as we win the game, it doesn't matter to me. Hey, Jeremy, it's been uh, four years now since your 722-yard game. So I just got to ask, prior to right now, when's the last time you know someone brought that up? Is that still kind of like um, a part that you, you have to deal with every day? Actually, when I, when I was coming home this uh, weekend, my, uh, one of my mentors, Kyle Wade, and, and his dad, uh, he actually asked me, like, how, how often do I get asked that question? So if that counts, it was probably, like, this week, yeah. So so it, 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 I get asked every time I meet somebody new, they be like, hey, man, like, great, great, great job, how's school? Just one question. How did you get seven? Yeah, 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 the whole spiel, yeah, so. Have you ever been more tired than you were that day? Uh, you know, as, as Penn State, I guess, you know, kind of, uh, you know, 
have you played a game or been out of practice or a training uh, session? Uh, uh, I, I, I thought that it was going to be the tiredest I've ever been until I got here and did a winter workout. And uh, yeah, <laughs> that's, the, that's the tiredest I've ever been in my life when, when we work out and stuff, so for sure. Anything else for Jeremy? Okay, well, well I'll ask one more then. <laughs> uh, and, and it's just going back to high school, uh, you know, I just got to ask, um, if you look on the all-time PIAA rushing list, uh, one of your teammates has you beat by about 52 yards on the top 20 of all time, mm -hmm. Lamont Wade. Mm -hmm. I'm just curious if you hear from him at all about <laughs> the fact that he's a little bit, you know, on you on the yeah. rush list. Or, uh, uh, no, we, we, we don't really talk about, uh, like, high school stuff no more. Um, but every once in a while, I'll come up and, he knows like I'm a running back, he plays defense, so I just tell him, I'll let him know, like, if it really mattered, it came down to it, like, you see I play running back, buddy, so, uh, yeah. <laughs>